Russell is the UC Berkeley Solar Vehicle Team. It's a group of primarily undergraduate students that designs, builds, tests, and races solar vehicles. These are street legal vehicles that will go on actual highways. We have license plates for them. Zephyr is our eighth generation solar vehicle. This is the eighth vehicle the team as a whole has uh, built and competed with since 1990 when the club was founded. Zephyr is basically an electric car with solar panels on top. It drives partly like a go-kart, just because of how light and nimble it is. The fastest we've gone in Zephyr um, was, I think, close to 80 miles an hour. The average speed is probably 40 on like a really good day. On like, a really nice sunny day, it would probably take four or five hours to charge the battery. From a fully charged battery with no sun, we can drive for about two hours. We have a term called the break-even speed, when uh, the amount of energy we get from the sun equals the amount of energy we're using to drive the car. We could take it down to Death Valley, where there's no gas station, no electric port station, and technically drive it as long as the sun is up and shining. Just last year, uh, we won at the Formula Sun Grand Prix at the F1 track in Austin, Texas. Being one of like the drivers during the first race that we've won in our like entire, I think it's like 20 something year history of this club um, was really amazing. It was super exciting because everyone kind of like runs out of our garage and like on the side of the tracks and just starts cheering and yelling. Every single lap, like I never got tired of it. Tachyon is going to be our next generation solar vehicle. Tachyon, however, is going to be a multi-seater cruiser class vehicle. Uh, and what that means is that it's going to be a four-seater vehicle. In the real world, they're going to be looking more towards like the cars that we normally see. Tachyon is going to be the bridge between solar cars of the theoretical standpoint and more real world applications. It is definitely a dream to potentially have solar vehicles become commercially available around the world. Solar car teams such as ours are essentially providing a proof of concept that they're actually possible.